eat healthy foods eating healthy foods is especially important for pregnant women your baby needs nutrients to grow healthy and strong in the womb eat plenty of colorful fruits and vegetables whole grains calcium rich foods and foods low in saturated fat take a daily parental vitamin taking a daily parental vit- multivitamin can help ensure you get the right amount of the key nutrients you and your baby need during pregnancy these include folic acid iron and calcium stay hydrated a pregnant woman body needs more water than it did before pregnancy aim for 8 or more cups each day go to your parental care checkups women should get regular parental care from a health care provider moms who don't get regular parental care are much more likely to have a baby with low birth weight or other complications if available consider group parental care Lisa, hello man. I am feeling nauseous. I need to see the doctor. Nurse, the doctor is in this room behind you in the right way. Thank you. I am Lisa. Doctor, I am not feeling well. I have been vomiting. Okay. Well, you can go to the lab and have some tests. Okay. Hello nurse, I am Lisa. Nurse, yes ma'am. How may I help you? Nurse says, yes ma'am. How may I help you? Lisa said, doctor sent me here for test. Nurse, okay. Okay, lie down on this skinny table. test avoid certain foods there are certain foods that women should avoid eating while pregnant don't eat raw or rare meats liver sushi raw eggs also in mayonnaise soft cheese feta free and pasteurized milk raw and unpasteurized animal products can cause food poisoning some fish even when cooked can be harmful to a growing baby because they are high in mercury don't drink alcohol don't drink alcohol before and during pregnancy and while breastfeeding drinking alcohol increase the risk of having a baby with fatal alcohol spectrum 
फटाल अलकोहल स्पेक्ट्रम डिसऑर्डर एफ ए एस टी एफ मीन फटाल ए मीन अल्कोहल एस मीन स्पेक्ट्रम और डी मीन डिसऑर्डर फैटाल अल्कोहल स्पेक्ट्रम डिसऑर्डर एफ ए एस टी कैन काज एब नॉर्मल फीशियल फीचर्स सवेयर लर्निंग डिसबिलिटीज एंड बी रियल इशूज अल्कोहल कैन इम्पेक्ट आ बेबीज हेल्थ इन द अर्लीस्ट स्टेज ऑफ प्रेगनेंसी बिफोर अ वोमेन मे नो शी इज प्रेगनेंट दिर फॉर वोमेन हाउ मैनी हाउ मे बिकम प्रेगनेंट आल्स शुड नॉट ड्रिंक अल्कोहल डोंट स्मोक स्मोकिंग इज अनहेल्थी फॉर यू एंड योर अनबॉर्ड चाइल्ड इट इंक्रीज द रिस्क ऑफ सडन sudden in pain death syndrome sudden in in pain death syndrome sids is abbreviation premature birth miscarriage and other poor outcomes get moving daily exercise or staying active in other ways can help you stay healthy during pregnancy check with 
your doctor to find out how much physical activity is right for you get a flow shot the flow shot flow can make a pregnant woman very sick and increase risks risks of complications for your baby the flow shot can protect you from serious illness and help protect your baby after birth to ask your doctor about getting a flow shot get plenty of sleep ample sleep 7 to 9 hours is important for you and your baby try to sleep on your left side to improve blood flow reduce stress reducing stress is crucial for improving birth outcomes pregnant women parents pilots yoga swimming and walking are also great activities for most pregnant people but be sure to check with your doctor first before starting any exercise program aim for 30 minutes of exercise most days of the week listen to your body do and do not overdo it what happens if injection goes wrong the mic Groupies in injection substances, injection equipment, or already existing on the skin, can enter the body, causing very serious infections. Similarly, incorrect injection techniques or erroneous injection location can cause blood vessel breakage, muscles or nerve damage, and paralysis. repeated injections in the same area cause hypohypertrophy which involves a lump of fatty tissues under your skin the area may feel lumpy film film or rubbery it also may be somewhat no practice kegels Kegel exercise strengthen the pelvic floor muscles which support your bladder balls and uterus that correctly this simple exercise can help make your delivery easier and prevent problems later with incontinence the best part no one can tell you doing them so you can practice kegels in the car while you are sitting at your desk
But being pregnant can be confusing, especially if it's your first time. How do you know which thing thinks is normal and which one isn't? According to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention (CDC), you should call your doctor if you have any of these symptoms. Dizziness or trending, shortness of breath, constant nausea and vomiting, trouble walking, edema, swelling of joints, decreased activity by the baby. Starting now will help you stay in shape during pregnancy, can lower your risk of miscarriage and has been proven to help reduce labor complications and length. Educate yourself, eat a new vegetable you have never tried, check out a book on pregnancy, decide what you, what you had like to do about birth control, you may need to find out how quickly after stopping birth control you can get pregnant. Quit smoking. There are many programs to help you. Take a parental vitamin. They can be prescribed by your practitioner or you can buy them over the counter. Ensure it contains 0.4 mg of folic acid. Ask your partner to join you on your new healthy habit changes. Track your cycle. Learning what you can about your cycles will help determine when you evaluate and when you conceive. These make for more accurate due dates. If you need a new practitioner interview before you become pregnant, ask your friends about pregnancy and parenthood. White chemicals that is not best for your health. Pregnant women should avoid as much as they can stressful situation. Recruit your loved ones to help you manage stress in your life. 
explain the right time to get pregnant if you are choosing to become pregnant at a time when you know that you are at your healthiest that increases your chances of having a healthy pregnancy and a healthy birth says doctor this not only means that women should make sure that they are healthy before they become pregnant but they also should consider their age before getting pregnant mothers who have children early in life earlier than 16 years old are late in life older than 40 are at greater risk for having a premature birth also women who become pregnant again too soon less than 18 months in between births are even more likely to have a premature baby staying active is important for your general health and can help you reduce stress improve circulation and boost your mood it can also encourage better sleep Take a pregnancy exercise class or walk at least 15 to 20 minutes a day at a moderate pace. Is an enclosed shaded areas or indoors in order to prevent overheating. Most people can continue during pregnancy. Being pregnant, however, might present challenges in the workplace. to stay healthy and productive on the job you need to understand how to relieve common pregnancy discomforts and know when a work task might jeopardize the pregnancy working through pregnancy tips here are some things you can do to make working while pregnant a comfortable and positive experience making things easier consider what could make your life easier at work for example traveling to work outside of peak hour having a temporary car space or working from home try to plan meetings so people come to you or set up video calls if you are pregnant casual worker it's okay to let you manager your manager know what you are uh, your ideal working hours are for example if you work most efficiently after 11 am when morning sick neck has eased your employer might be able to give you these offers think ahead about how to respond to tricky situations for example people might comment on or even touch your belly it's okay to tell people not to do this if it makes you uncomfortable eat your body at home rest when you can and go to bed early if possible try to relax regularly for example get into the habit of having a warm for or bath or reading before bed ask for and accept help from family and friends support from people around you can give you more time to rest do regular gentle to moderate physical activity to improve your sleep boost your energy ease back pain and more pre cook and freeze meals so you don't have to cook as often this is great for days when you are really tired for many women pregnancy symptoms start to settle down in the second trimester you might find your experience morning sickness less and your mood and energy levels are improving Should 
आप प्रेग्नेंट हो therefore pregnant women can work 40 hours a week if the working conditions are safe for them to do so if a pregnant employee begins to work over 40 hours a week and is subject to a lot of stress it could be harmful to their health and the health of Most people can continue working during pregnancy being pregnant however might present challenges in the workplace to stay healthy and productive on the job you need to understand how to relieve common pregnancy discomfort and know when a work task might you prioritize the pregnancy may allah give you a mother long healthy life Please subscribe to my channel and like the videos. Thanks for watching. Dear viewers